conversations, man. How was practice on that today? Wet, but how do you feel like you all responded today? Uh, it was good. I know that uh, these first this first practice that we had yesterday, you know, we were a little rusty, just like Coach Diggy said yesterday. Uh, it was the first practice we had since we've been traveling and all that. But I think it was good today to kind of come out in this bad weather, knowing that it could it could be bad when we play Wednesday as well. So I think it was good that we got that preparation in today. What are you seeing on, on film from Auburn in terms of just what you feel like you might be able to do against this defense that's kind of been struggling this season? Uh, I mean, even though they struggled, they, they still look good on film. I mean, they're big up front. They got a lot of uh, tall, big, fast guys in the back end as well. And there's a lot of games that I think that they should have won that they just kind of lost <laughs> close. But, you know, you got to respect them just because of who they are. They're SEC team. You know, they're going to have athletes just like we do. So, you know, we're preparing for a battle. How did you feel to just finally play, man? Because it seemed like you all, you all hadn't played. Uh, at first, it felt good just to, you know, kind of relax and sit back and heal up for all, all the older guys. But now you just you kind of get tired of going against each other and doing all this scout work and stuff. So I know that we're ready to go out there and play, and I'm sure they are as well. People, Some people are saying that it'll be an upset. But you all shouldn't look at it like it's been an upset because you all are having, you know, better years than Auburn is having. Yeah, I mean, uh, I, I'm, you can't really say as upset for either team because – you know, the best team that goes out there and plays that day and the team that prepared best for the other team is going to go out there and win. And, you know, we're just preparing and trying to give ourselves a shot to uh, have a chance to win a game. How, how at the much end. does that win over Ole Miss give you guys confidence? Having already beaten an SEC team, um, you know, how, how much how much impact does that have, that common opponent? Because obviously you guys beat them and then they beat Auburn. So. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, it was definitely a big uh, confidence booster, especially for us, especially being undefeated at the time. And we knew that uh, Auburn, or not Auburn, but Ole Miss kind of got after us the year before. So we kind of played with the chip on our shoulder. But uh, that was a big confidence booster. But we know that this is a different team, so we're going to have to prepare for them differently. Do you mentally prepare any differently? Because it's probably going to be raining on Wednesday, man. You being a quarterback, does that bother you at all? Uh, definitely bothers you a little bit just because, you know, you'd rather have it sunny 75 out there throwing it. But, you know, you got to play in all conditions. That's why you play football. You play basically not all year, but – most of the year, and you're playing in cold, hot, and rainy, so you got to be prepared for whatever. Do you wear a glove when it's raining? Uh, no. Too slippery. Cool. Will, it, will it help? I mean, the SMU game, it rained, and mm -hmm. you didn't seem to have much trouble on that game, so would that help with the preparations, too? Yeah, I mean, we, we're definitely confident in our abilities that we can go out there and uh, uh, succeed in, in any uh, mm -hmm. weather conditions. And uh, like I said, today was, was good for us handling the ball, centers, and quarterbacks, and receivers, too. Thank <laughs> you.